hello everyone welcome to my channel today I'm going to show you on how to create a graph using the spreadsheet that you have created so I'm going to use this spreadsheet that we all see here on my screen and the spreadsheet is going to address or a uh, create a graph that will talk about different type of sports also as it will also indicate uh, the number of students enrolled for each sport so when you create a graph firstly you highlight the spreadsheet make sure you don't include the headings in your highlighting uh, the headings i'm referring to the main heading and the subheading but the column headings that are actually part of your spreadsheet you highlight them then i'm going to go to insert on the tools as indicated after that you look at your set of tools and then you will see that you have charts as indicated here then i will click i'm going to insert a column graph because there are different type of charts so when i click here on the column or insert a bar there i will see that there are different types of column graphs so i'm going to take the 2d first column there and then my chart will just come on my screen so remember everything that you see on a graph comes from your spreadsheet that is why the first thing is to highlight your spreadsheet so now the graph is here what what i do on the graph i have to make changes and add the things that i need to add now the first thing let's look at the chart title when i click there on chart title i can highlight and rename it to be what i want it to be so in this case i will just type abc college and then i need a second line of typing still in my chart title so i'll press enter and type sport played there so after that i will need my title on the left this is the exit title and also my title at the below my my graph so what do you do you go to make sure make sure that your graph is selected first you will see by the handles around your graph and then on top on your tools you will see chart tools there and then design will dis will, will also be part of it make sure design is open and then you will go and choose chart element on the left of the tools and then you go to exist titles now let's start with vertical when you click vertical now it will open a space where you can type a title for your numbers on the left hand side so i'm going to highlight and here i will write number of students as i'm typing and then now i need another a uh, slot here where i can type a uh, type of spot so i will go to a chart element again and then exit titles horizontal and then there i can highlight again and then i will type the weight the sentence type of sport type of sport so after typing all this now you will see that my graph is still on the same place with my spreadsheet so i can move it to be alone on its own sheet at the bottom you see there there is sheet one so currently it means everything that you see on my screen is on one sheet so i want to move this graph to be on its own sheet i click on the plain area there to make sure that my graph is still selected so that i can still find chart tools and design and then i can go to the right hand side where it says move chart when i click it it gives me a screen where i have to choose whether i want it to remain on sheet one or i have to move it to a new sheet so when i choose new sheet that sheet will come named chart one so when i click ok now you will observe that my graph is now alone my spreadsheet doesn't show anymore because at the bottom there i don't have sheet one only i have chart one created so if i want to go back to my original work i have to click sheet one then i will see that the spreadsheet is still there the graph is gone so the graph has been moved to chart one as indicated there so i'm going to click click chart one again now on chart one i'm going to insert uh, the data labels on top of my data 
series here so i'm going to make sure that all the numbers that are displaying let me go back to sheet one all these numbers that you see here they must come now and be displayed on my graph so let me click chart one again now here you see that we know that okay these bars that are going up on a graph are actually talking to numbers that you see on the left of your graph but we need to know specifically what exactly is that number so you just click on top of your data services and then you will see now it's selected so it means now there will be a number on top of this but we don't have it now so the quickest way to do it is to make sure that you can see that your graph is selected then you will find this set of icons and there's a plus sign there which is green you click on it and then you go and make a tick inside data labels put a tick you will see now your data labels are coming as numbers the same numbers that we have seen on our spreadsheet so in case if it's not numbers only and you also have something else if you go to data labels and have more options there you can click the small arrow next to it again you will see that it gives you more options on what you can add or how you can display them or maybe you can even uh, add names that are going with those numbers you see when i put my mouse on top what is what is happening on my graph if i put my mouse on top of um, another option you see inside end what is, what is happening with my numbers so if you leave it like that by uh, just ticking there it will just be above your 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 graphs all the numbers there right so this graph when it's uh, here alone you can print it on its own without showing the uh, uh, spreadsheet at the back so it's when you have moved it to to be on its own sheet so thank you for watching this is how you create a graph specifically a column graph and adding data labels on it while you have moved it to be on its own sheet thank you for watching have a nice day Thank you.